you beautiful bastards. Hope you're having a fantastic Wednesday. Welcome back to the Philip DeFranco Show. And let's just jump in. The first thing we're talking about today is the most requested story. It is the most requested by a mind. That is the new speculation and controversy of an assault on one of the largest creators here on YouTube by another massively large person here on YouTube. And the two creators involved in the story are the Gabby Show and Rice Gun. Before we move any further, understand the reason I'm talking about this is because, yay, YouTube drama. I love that. No, I hate YouTube drama. The reason I'm talking about this. Is YouTube is no longer a little playground. Anytime I know these two put something down, they reach either one to six million people. Depending on what actually happened in this situation, we have either an assault, an exaggeration, a hoax, or just straight up slander. So that's why, other than a big name of the story, I will talk about. Yeah, no, these two creators have history. This one makes a lot of roast slash bash videos, and he did one on Gabby. He by no means was the only creator making bash videos on Gabby. She had her own controversy, most of it was around her stealing jokes. But fast forward to last night, Gabby realizes she's at the same party as Rice Gum, and she decides to Snapchat. Rice Gum is here, and I know that Riley, I want to challenge him to a battle. But I know he won't do it, and it's Alex's birthday, so I'm not like ruining the party, you know what I mean? And honestly, if Bryce Gum ever wants to like live freestyle battle, like you're on TV right now, bitch, I'll murder you. Hey, Bryce Gum, I just challenged you to a live battle on Snapchat. Would you do it? Live battle on one, you do it. Let's see. No, I don't want to do it. Alright, so Bryce Gum and I have a skill today. It's fine. I think we can go back. Let's go good. No? You don't want to do it? And then the next Snapchat, Gabby says something happened off camera. So update, sorry, don't listen, I'm crying. Um, Roy said something that joke was very funny, and he hit me in the middle of the party and shattered my phone. I can show you that instead. Everybody's like, but he hit you, and I was like, yeah, he did. And my phone was broken, the screen is broken, the back camera is broken. Phone. Also showing a video and photo of a scratch that she said she received from Rice Gum. And then she went on to say that there was actually more to it as well. And let's say he did not have any sort of evidence, just like eyewitnesses, of him grabbing me, pulling me down, and hitting me, and like twisting my arm. He still shattered my phone. Now from this, there was, of course, a big reaction. There were many people who instantly 